All right, so I've figured out who we have to talk to for mission two for this particular mission set. It's this guy, Vernon Peeve. Hi, my name is Simon. I'm Vernon Peeve, okay? Are you making fun of me or something? I should probably be at work instead of talking to you. My boss is going to kill me. You look a little angry. What's wrong? Angry? I'm not angry. I don't get angry. There's no point. None. There's no point doing anything in life when arrogant jerks like that meathead at the gym insults you for being short and out of shape. <sighs> okay, fine. So I'm no weightlifter. Why do you think I'm at the gym? I want to work out. Oh, the nerve of some people. Uh... <laughs> Maybe if you were a little less confrontational? Confrontational? Me? Confrontational? That's ridiculous. He's the one who wants 200 simulons for a year-long membership. Can you believe that? 200 simulons is almost as much as my rent. That's criminal is what it is. Don't tell me about confrontational. He's a thief. Oh, the humanity. Uh, what do we say next? Do we have to get him to like us? I think we do. And then we can press on with the mission. Oh, well, it just gave us all there. So we got body two, got him uh, pay his membership, and get a... And we've got an impress uh, Eddie Renalin, which I think's the, the uh, you know, the, the boxer um, that we've probably seen at some point several times in the game so far. Um, don't think we've actually spoken to him yet. So... We're going to go down to the gym area. First, I'm going to sleep, obviously, because we're not going to be able to access it right now. At least I don't think we can. Let's just quickly check. Yeah, we can't access it yet. So, we're going to go home. Oh, here he is. I found you. Eddie Renalin. Okay. I've heard of you. Haven't you heard of me? Eddie Renalin. The strongest, the handsomest, most buffed up beefcake the world has ever seen. I'd like to join the gym. Super. Just super, Simon. Your days of flabby, weak-kneed mediocrity are over. The best 200 Simulon decision you ever made. You do have 200 Simulons, don't you? Uh, yeah, I can pay. That's what I like to see. You're on the ball. You have that get up and go. Once you bring the Simulons to me, you can jump in there and straight lifting those weights, okay? So what are you waiting for? Ah, uh, little pun there. Haha, <laughs> I just made that up. Beautiful. Uh, okay, so is that everything? Do we have to not get his relationship up as well? I believe we do. Yes, we have to impress him. So let's quickly try and do that. Let's not call him a meathead, he won't like that. Ah. Okay, we'll be right back. Hopefully he stays about there near the gym. He should, because he's, you know, uh, a buff guy. Um, it's pretty typical for people to stay in the same location. Um, I'm going to quickly get my uh, my stupid meters up. Okay, it's gym time now. Um, hopefully he's still there. Roundabouts, is he? Uh, he's not there. So is he in the gym now? Eddie? That's not him. Oh, here he is. Okay, let's start talking. Oh, we're almost there. Uh, this one should do. There we go. Check out these biceps. Whoa, who? Oh, is that you, Simon? Is that really you? Holy flyweights, kids. For a second, I thought someone had stuck a mirror down in front of me. But hey, look at you now. All right. Pretty soon, I'll be as big as you. Let's not get crazy here, but you're on your way. You look so good, you should enter the Raging Chicken weightlifting competition. Right upstairs, near the pool. We compete We compete every day from 3pm to 5pm. I'm guessing this is another job thing for us to do. Um, there's lots of those. I'll sponsor you, and don't you worry, I only judge it. Oh, that makes me feel a lot better. So, did we get that guy his membership? I thought that was the whole point, or we just meant to get a membership for us. I guess that's what it was. So let's go upstairs and, um, okay, so it takes us automatically. So this is the other area we can 
go, can we go on this? Oh yeah, okay, we can go on all this stuff as well. And yeah, it's probably just gonna get our body up uh, the same way as the punching bags. Um, I don't think it's any better in any way. I don't know why there's so much empty space here. Um, what else is here? So yeah, here's the job thing. There's uh, um, There should be a shower somewhere upstairs, I'm sure. Is there no shower set up? There's a pool. Maybe we can get washed up in there. Let me actually see, can we go in the pool and try uh, getting washed up? Oh, we can't actually go in the pool. Uh, so there's no showers up here, but whatever. Uh, can we do this yet? I don't think we can. Yeah, we have to wait until that time. Uh, well, seeing as we're here, let's uh, jump on the treadmill. Okay, that was a good workout. Let's try this. The power lifter. Compete in a battle of brawn. Press the A button rapidly to lift the weight. Press down to set the weight. Then mash the A button again before pressing up for the final lift. Okay, so it's just a combination of the, the two. Pretty much A and up and down, like most things. Most of the things are like, I don't know, a couple of buttons. And now we have to go talk to Hester Prem, who should be in here. Yep, here she is. Hi, my name is Simon. It's so delightful to meet you, Simon. I'm Hester Prem. I run the Sim Valley Library, so I'll stop by for a visit anytime. But be sure to wash your hands if you plan to touch any books. Okay, bit of a clean freak, maybe? Uh, will the library be open soon? That, my young friend, is a super question. Thank you for asking. Are you going to give me an answer? Uh, <laughs> uh, so what's the answer? Get snippy with me again and I'll call your uncle. Oh, she knows uncle. If you must know, the library won't be open for some time. I'm afraid it has a rather disgusting bookworm infestation. Uh, so she is a bit of a bookworm, it seems. Um, can we call an exterminator? No, that's the other problem. So many people in Sim Valley still have books checked out and have library fees to pay that we can't afford an exterminator. But if you can get people to return their books and squash the bookworms and, um, read one chapter in my new cookbook, then I'll set you up with a library card on the spot. Ooh, okay, let's uh, get to that. Oh wait, we still have stuff to read. Um, what the heck does cooking have to do with this? Uh, so the cooking book's probably the thing that's going to get our cooking stat up, I'm sure. Well, 
Call me a silly goose, but I wrote a cookbook last year, but couldn't sell a single copy. And if you'd try out some recipes, I'd be very happy. Uh, I guess we could try out a few recipes. So let's check out these goals and see what we're up against. Destroy all 15 bookworms. Not entirely sure how we're going to go about doing that. Get three books from other sims um, and return three books to Hester. Learn cooking. Yeah, see? Yeah. Uh, we'll learn cooking from getting that book at some point. But uh, yeah, let's start off with going to the library and seeing if we can spot any uh, bookworms there. Um, I don't know if we'll actually be able to go in or not. I think we're going the right way. I can't really tell. Oh, maybe not. Uh, I think if we keep going down this way and go round, we will. Um, <laughs> yeah, I still don't really know uh, the entire landscape myself either. Yeah, I'm sure we're going to go down that little hole there at some point. So this is the library, uh, library area. Uh, I'm going to open up. I'm going to open up the map here and show you where everything is. I can't. Were we? I think we might have been down here. Maybe, yeah, I think we're down there. Yeah, I remember the the, sh uh, the shelter here. What's this thing here? Jail, okay, yeah, yeah. We're, we were here talking to her in that building. And then we went up all this road, all the way around to the library here. So, can we go in? Yes, we can go in the library now. So, how do we deal with these things? Oh, we just squished them. So, I'm going to quickly speed run through that. That was a cool little transition there. <laughs> yeah, that's a lot better than the uh, one that we get for walking through a room or something like the, of the sorts. All right, so we've done that. We've squished all the bugs, all the worms. Oh, what's this? Oh, so we can just pick anything. Okay, I thought she was gonna give us the book. Whatever, so we just uh, go to the library to read the books here. So this is the place where we learn to get our cooking up. Um, after this, I'm gonna check what other steps we need to figure out uh, how to get up. But we definitely know how to get our cooking up. Mechanicals one, I know that. But I think there's another one. I think there's um, this uh, six total. Um, okay, so as you can see, I've uh, been secretly getting up my body and charisma. Um, with, you know, last few parts uh, off screen. So we need to figure out how to get mechanical. Creativity as well up. Uh, and logic. Creativity is probably something like painting, a picture, or drawing. Uh, I'm, I'm just certain of that. Uh, I don't know about logic. And probably something at the computer. Now there's a computer at the bottom of the library there, so I might give that a, a try. And cooking, yeah, we figured that out. So I'm gonna go down to that computer downstairs and see if that works. Huh. Yeah, oh wait, no, that's to connect something. Can we go through this door? Nope. Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna have to figure out things gradually. So what do we have to figure out? We still have to figure out, um, well, let's look at this first. So we have to get three books, from other sims and return those books to Hester. So I don't know who we have to go to directly, probably, maybe anyone, who knows? We'll, we'll figure out who probably reads books or not. But uh, yeah, we have to figure out creativity, logic and mechanical, those are only three left. Uh, yeah, to figure out where we have to go for them. And we will, all in due time, I'm sure. <laughs> 